Well, 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 welcome you guys. I know it's been a while. Today we're gonna have a very interesting video. It's gonna be about the chase. As many of y'all know, I got in jail again, like two months ago and I crashed pretty bad. I totaled my car. It was, it was pretty interesting discombobulated definition, you know? But anyways, without any further ado, let's get to the video. And I'm gonna be reacting to it as well, so it's my first time watching it also. And I'm pretty excited to see what's gonna happen, so. Let's see over here. We got just him cruising. And then it should be me over here. But there he goes. Now he accelerates. I think he saw me already. Let's see. <laughs> this is so crazy. It's like I get goosebumps just watching it because it was. It was pretty traumatic night. There he goes with the lights. I can't believe it. I just, just still to this day, I, I can't believe I did that. It's just horrible. I'm very stupid to be honest with y'all. I wish I didn't, I wouldn't have done that, but it's too late and I can't just get stuck on the past, I have to move on and live with it. So let's see, now he's still still trying to catch up. Right here I think is where I saw the lights and I was like, here we go again. <laughs> and yeah, he's about to start catching up right here. Because, I mean, I had a BRZ, it tops out at 125. <laughs> It's pretty goofy vehicle, but yeah, here he is, he caught up a little bit and then I decided to take the exit because obviously I'm not gonna outrun him on the highway with that specific car. So then, here we go. <laughs> this is crazy. Here I took on the other side and now right here I kind of lose him a little bit. I'm gonna open that distance little by little because I know these roads pretty well and I'm pretty good at cutting up through traffic so not good enough to where I didn't get my right rear wheel caught up on the grass and then crashed but still and here we go, we open that gap. Hardly even can see us anymore. And I wish I would have taken that exit right after that Christian school on Highway 90. I wish I would have taken that. I'm pretty sure I had enough time to take it and then just vanish. But I hesitated there and that's where he caught up with me. And you can see everybody, that's the funny thing is that everybody gets out of his way and he still couldn't keep up, like he still couldn't catch up to me when it came to this right here, the traffic. I was cutting up through incoming traffic and regular traffic and traffic and I still had so much distance between us. And him, every single car, like you can see every single car moved out of his way and he still couldn't keep up. That's pretty embarrassing for the deputy. But anyways, here we are. I mean, you, you can't even see me anymore. I mean, I, I opened that gap. I had probably like eight or nine seconds to take a left and, um, after that Christian school. But I didn't. I was going to, and then I was like, no, no. And then I kept going straight, and that's where I lost all my lead. Like, I, I lost so much time there because I kept hesitating. Should I go or should I not? And I was kind of afraid I'm going to get caught on that curb right on that turn. And I, that's why I didn't go. But, I mean, as you can tell, everybody's moving out of his way, and he still, he still can't catch up to me. That is very, very embarrassing. <laughs> Very embarrassing, but here we are, we we'll keep going. That was a pretty good squeeze on his side. The quality is pretty bad, I'm sorry about that guys, but I mean that's what that's what the Oregon police 
sent me, so that's what I can only work with. So here it is, and that's what right here I could have taken left right here, right here I could have taken left and just disappeared, but I was hesitating too much, and right here is where he starts catching up to me. On the straight line with no traffic coming I mean, out, my car is not very quick. If if it was like a 350Z or something, which I was planning on getting before that, it would have been way, way better. But yeah, that's, that's it. <laughs> We're dealing with what we have, so. Very bad, very bad. And right here, he caught up to me very quick because I thought I was gonna turn left and I was like, ooh, ooh, let me try to fool him a little bit. So then, instead of turning left, I went to the right. And then, oh, but watch. <laughs> See, I couldn't fool him. I don't know who am I fooling myself. But, uh, and right here, because I wanted to take him on the back roads, right on 90, right before the middle school. So then right here, I took a U-turn. And I was going crazy then. I was cutting up between oncoming traffic and regular traffic that goes the regular way. And I was I was doing some risky, risky stuff. And like I was like, holy cow, I, I actually made that. I actually squeezed between these cars. But yeah, pretty crazy. I was like, how did I just not crash? And then eventually, I guess, I ran out of luck. Because you can get only so many times lucky, you know what I mean? But here I took right on 90, going towards the middle school, because that's what I know. I know the back roads right there perfectly. And if I would have gotten there, that would have been it, because I have been practicing so many times to go there and be able to escape. But right here, again, cutting up, and right here is going to be the crash right ahead, here somewhere. There was oncoming traffic, I squeezed between the oncoming traffic and then as I went to the right my right rear tire got caught and I spun out, I hit that pickup truck where you saw it flipped over and then I flipped four times into a tree on the left side can't even see what happened it's crazy how fast everything happened, I mean you gotta think I was going 120 and he doesn't even know where I am like as you can tell he's just I don't know what he's doing what is he what is he doing <laughs> what is little bro doing I'm not I'm way back there where is he going <laughs> okay there there he goes he makes a u-turn I was gonna say where is little bro going and then he's gonna come back and then right here oh he slammed on his brakes there we go and there i am <laughs> oh good climbing out like nothing happened are you serious just open the door and climb out i can't believe like a the adrenaline that night i did not feel any pain and he right here you can see he was literally just staring at me he was like what is going on with this guy like he was just he was, I could see, when I looked him in the eyes, his soul was frozen. Like, I could, I could see in his eyes that he couldn't believe that I was alive. Or like, I was able to climb out like that. And then, yeah, I just keep climbing out. And, I mean, that's pretty much it. After that, he just arrests me and puts me in the car and takes me to hospital and I don't, I'm trying to explain to him that I don't need to go to hospital because I drink milk and my bones are all good and like I'm not able to break anything that easily just because of crash or maybe just because I got lucky that it wasn't worse crash but that was it really and I mean, he took me to a hospital, then I didn't need any help there. I told them I don't need nothing. And then they just took me to jail, and that was that was pretty much it. It was like, till 3, 4 o'clock, I crashed around like 9, 30, something like that. But that was it, y'all, guys. I know you all have been wanting to see the police chase, and blew up my phone DMing me. Oh, but where is the chase? Oh, but you promised to post a video. Just shut up. Ah. Like, I got so tired of these people. 
texting me and keep spamming me and wondering what's going on. I know, I know, and I tried to explain that I'm waiting on them. It took a while for them to send the video. As soon as I got the video, like I literally got it yesterday. So right now I'm recording and then for the rest of the day I'm gonna edit it and then I'm probably gonna post it tomorrow around like 12 o'clock. I'll finish and ready to go. So make sure y'all stay tuned because I post daily shorts on different content and also let me know in the comments what kind of content would y'all like me to make or what would you like to watch like I can make more reaction videos or I can make vlogs or I can make motivational content which is what I've been doing or I can I can make anything really just let me know in the comments what y'all like the most and then I will make sure I provide that for y'all so but for right now peace